it's about eight o'clock. I'm walking down with Liam so that we can get ready to go. It's pretty typical uh, morning. My mom and Noble probably have their two horses nearly ready. So by the time we get down there, we can just get rocking and rolling. So welcome to Hope Valley Farm. Come on, Kim! Let's go! Are you riding? Yeah?
grocery shopping. <laughs> and uh, she and I both were out of bananas, which just will not do. Um, we do bananas for breakfast on the regular, so had to go get more bananas. Um, so today had a really great day so far. It's not over yet. It's far from over. Uh, let's see. Mom and Gabriel and Noble and Sabine kicked us off this morning. And they all... Mom and Gabriel are probably at about second level type work and Noble and Sabine are uh, doing some training level questions. Uh, they're I mean, a fairly new partnership. They just had their anniversary. So I always think of when you've only been with a horse for a year, that's still pretty new. For both of you. Um, and she's going through some, you know, typical off the track thoroughbred things and she's working through them very nicely. Uh, next up was Phoenix and we did um, a lot with a turn on the forehand and started kind of the introduction of the changes seeing how quickly he would um, move his feet around, shift some things. Um, I really wasn't quite certain what I was talking about, but he definitely is trying hard, so that was really cool. Uh, then was Ty. I'm trying to make him a little bit more of a solid citizen because next Friday, not this Friday, but next Friday, um, I'm going to ride him in a lesson with JJ, and uh, so he he needs to be slightly less feral <laughs> by that time. Um, which, in all honesty, he's really doing a fantastic job for a big, like growing, still five-year-old. So I'm very proud of him. Um, I say feral and needing to become come more onto the payroll all met with love. Um, and then I got on Vivi uh, and she's been doing really nicely. Um, we did some uh, work towards more massage like steps so hopefully you guys will be able to see that. Um, and then I got on Cherum. I wasn't able to get any video of Cherum, unfortunately. Um, it just, the battery, it does not like it when I take videos of the whole ride and I didn't have anybody to hand my phone off to to put it in the tripod. So, um, anyway, she is doing great. We got pine shoes on, which makes all the difference in the world to her. She has um, smaller feet than I would like to see for such a big bodied horse that she is. Um, and she just wears her toes and her walls of her feet down just by the sheer weight of her and the fact that she kind of drags her feet around out in the field. So um, last week she got the hind shoes on and uh, I got a ride in the end of last week, first time in the hinds, which felt great and then today she felt wonderful too. So we're trying to get a lot more lateral work done now that she's comfortable back there and increasing rideability. Um, her owner pops in, you know, um, down from Baltimore and back. Um, she 
wasn't able to as much last year, obviously. Uh, but this year, uh, we're trying to make a run for it. Um, and then Tempe, Tempe did great. Um, today was like the first day that I've gotten her to lick and chew. Hi, bug! And want to uh, check in with me. So that was fantastic. I loved that. Uh, not only that, but I was able to get a leg up and over. And so I was able to mount from the left, dismount on the right. I like to kind of do that up and over, up and over, up and over several times with them so that they, um, they know not to get worried when they see you out of either eye all of a sudden. Um, so that's really great. I'm hoping this week the goal with her is to end up taking a few steps um, walking on her bareback and then introduction of her tack. Um, so we'll uh, hopefully be able to do that. I was really impressed with where she ended up today. So I think we're right on track for that. Um, and we'll see. We'll see how that goes. Um, so anyway, I've, uh, I've got a couple lessons tonight, it, like we start up in about an hour um, with two lessons and then I do um, the tag room chat this week. I get to be involved in that with the Team Tate Academy. Um, so I think it's me and Katie, one of the Katie's. Um, We'll be on tonight talking about uh, a few videos, the in-hand work with Denali and the baby shoulder in with Denali. So I'm really excited about those things because baby horses are right up my alley. Obviously, that's my, that's my jam. So I'm excited to talk about that tonight and always excited for lessons. Have a really great group of boarders and students and uh, everything going on. So uh, should be a good afternoon. So we'll uh, update you in a little bit. I'm trying out this whole like vlogging a day thing. 